why we use correlation analysis correlation analysis is done to see the relationship of our variables in other words a correlation tells us the relationship between our independent variables and dependent variables correlation also tells us the impact which our independent variables are putting on our dependent variable correlation or correlation analysis also tells us the relationship between our variables are positive or negative so it also shows the direction of our variables number 2 it tells us about the significant or insignificant relationship of our variables it also tells that our variable relationship is strong or they have a weak relationship with each other the three one is a maximum relationship in correlation so if your correlation is coming more than one then your results are invalid so maximum one is the limit so your maximum correlation can be 0.98 or 0.88 something but it cannot cross the one limit barrier next we have next point is correlation tells you the positive relationship between your variables or negative relationship with your variables for example your two variables a and b and the correlation is coming 0.789 significant to start then it means it's positive and significant relationship between the variables and if in case your correlation between your two variables a and b is coming minus point 638 then your very then your correlation of your variable is negative next the weak relationship the weak correlation is when your correlation falls between 0.1 and 0.3 then it's considered as weak relationship okay 0.1 or 0.3 if your correlation of your variable a and b falls in this category or in this range then your variable a and b have weak relationship if your correlation of your variable a and b falls between 3.1 and 0.6 then it's considered moderate relationship if your variable a and b relationship is 0.61 or above then it's considered as strong relationship so this is an example of correlation table as you can see This is the final output in APA format style. As you can see, on the top there are variables name, and the left as well there are variable name. And you can see there is one written everywhere. This is the maximum value. So your correlation will be less than one, not more than one. And then you see this correlation, for example, of BI, which is brand image, and BL, which is brand loyalty. It's point three one zero two star. So what does two star means? It means the correlation is significant at level zero point zero five level two tail. So it's significant. Okay. Then they all shows you correlation all are positive. As you can see, there is no sign of minus. Let's see its uh, interpretation. Example, example number one. The correlation between brand image and brand loyalty is point three one zero significant. so what does this shows it shows that the very this shows that the relationship between brand image and loyalty is positive number 1 number 2 the relationship between these two variables is weak and the third point it tells us that the relationship between brand image and brand loyalty is significant with each other this means if brand image increases then brand loyalty with will also increase with it this will not happen for example if brand image is increasing and brand loyalty is, is decreasing then there is no relationship okay your hypothesis will be rejected keep that in mind so if your independent variable is increasing then your brand, then your dependent variable will also increase with it so this shows that the brand image has positive and significant impact on brand loyalty okay let me explain with you one more example so it will be clear to you this is another example the correlation between product and brand loyalty is 0.8162 significant star this shows that these variables have positive relationship number 2 they have strong relationship and they have significant relationship with each other 
this means that if product increases then brand loyalty also increases if product quality increases then brand loyalty also increases with it this shows that product has positive and significant impact on brand loyalty